we back in action? I think we're back in action. What is up, everybody? Thank you for tuning back into the channel. We took some time off. I was just being mad, lazy, slacking. You know, and sometimes you get in these creative ruts. Sometimes that happens to people. You just got to refresh. You got to start new. It happens to the best of us. Um, so getting back after it, getting back on the grind. We're going to have weekly videos posted. It's probably going to be one video a week. I'll post it on the weekend. I'll film it at some point during the week. And then I'm going to have a weekly video posted, whether it's a day in the life video, a full day of eating, a workout video, whatever it may be. Quick shout out to the pups. But yeah, like I was saying, I'm going to get back on the grind. Going to get back to uh, filming weekly. We got a mic finally, so we got some good audio for you guys. Um, and yeah, Things are going good. We are currently 14 and a half weeks out from competition. We are competing November 20th at the NPC Armed Forces and Battle Royale. I am not in the Armed Forces, obviously, so I will be competing in the Battle Royale section of the show, but super excited for that. Um, we're already 10 pounds lighter than when we started our initial cut for our show in July. We're sitting in a really good spot right now. We don't need to cut super hard for the time being. Cardio is only at like 15 minutes. In terms of the meal plan, I'll have more videos and more updates on the meal plan. I've already gotten my breakfast in, which is the same as older videos. It's just the egg whites, the protein. Got my meal one in, which is the ground beef with some rice. Uh, same old, same old, still sticking to the plan. Again, the things that we change the most are gonna be like varying amounts, not necessarily foods. Cause I found out what works the best for me and I just stick to it. My arm is getting tired. But yeah, so today it's, uh, we have chest and triceps. So still really exhausting the tries after doing a full push workout. Um, just switching up the plan. I've been running this for about two weeks. I'll probably be running this split for about another two weeks and then switch it up come maybe four weeks or five weeks, something like that. But yeah, I'm super excited. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling back to getting on the videos. I'm super excited. I hope to bring you guys some good stuff some good content. Amp Stups, the supplement sponsor. We have some awesome things coming out. We have some new drops coming. I got new merch coming on the way. What else am I rambling about? Yeah, I'll keep you guys updated with the day. Like I said, we got our breakfast in. We got meal one in. Now we're just going to get ready for the gym, make our pre-workout, and get to it. So let's go. Woo! What's up, little boy? How are you? Is this what we're looking for? Is this what we're looking for? Ooh, yes it is. Let's see that. That's what we're looking for. Some pump. Okay. This is my little go-to, if that'll focus. I go a half scoop of the pre-workout straight into the shaker, like so. I'll do about a half scoop into the shaker. Then I'm gonna take one scoop of the pump, throw that in there. It's chest day, so actually, I think we're gonna do two scoops. Then, finally, we're gonna do one scoop of the EAAs. All right, and then last for the pre-workout, I'm gonna take a full scoop into eight ounces of water, and then I'm just gonna drink that straight to the dome. I'll try to do this one-handed. Obviously, to mix your pre-workout, you need a shish kebab thingy. Turn these lights on. Someone commented the other day, they were like, why do you have your lights on in the middle of the day? It's dark in here. I wanted some light. All right, cheers. Woo! Ah, all right, let's go smash the workout. Okay, off to the gym. So the only really unfortunate thing about this gym that I go to, actually there's quite a few unfortunate things, but I'll save that for another day. But one of the really unfortunate things about this gym that I go to is that they are sticklers about filming in the gym. I don't know why, it's super annoying. I've had multiple run-ins with these people. Yeah, they're just like super whack about me filming in the gym, so I probably won't be able to film much of the workout today. Maybe I'll get like a little clip, a little flex in the mirror for you guys, and maybe like a little physique update in the locker room. Fortunately for the workout itself, I probably won't be able to film much of it, but like I said, I'll get a little physique update for you guys, and then I'll bring it back after the workout, and we'll have fun for the rest of the day. So stay tuned. I appreciate you guys. Thank you for making it this far. Thank you for still watching. Um, I truly appreciate all of you. I'm going to try to make these videos better and better every week, so let's get it. What the fuck? Woo! All right. Goddamn. All right, it's super bright out here. I don't even know if this is coming out well, but workout is complete. I was super fatigued today, but regardless, we got it done. Um 
We hit a chest and triceps workout today. A little bit fatigued, but we got it done. We had working sets of 15. So three working sets by 15 reps. And then I might add like a drop set. I might add, you know, a super set or something like that. But three focused working sets. Um, feeling really good. Working on our weaknesses. Calories are still high. Energy is high. So I'm definitely making some gains. But uh, other than that, things are going good. What's up, brother? Um, so yeah, I'm enjoying it. Things are going good. Uh, I'm going to go back to the house and eat the classic staple post-workout meal, which is going to be 60 grams of quick oats and one scoop of protein. We're going to get to it. I'll finish uh, filming the rest of the video for the day, a little vlog. I might do uh, some shopping later. I'm not even sure. Day one of getting back into the YouTube grind. Who's messaging me? Who's hitting me up? Anyways, I appreciate you guys. Stay tuned. Let's have a good rest of the day. So as usual, post-workout is always gonna be 60 grams of quick oats with a scoop of protein. The 60 grams in the scoop has been a staple literally since the day I started prep. Even into my cutting diet, even during the bulk, even like two or three days out from my show, I was still consuming the uh, 60 grams of quick oats with a scoop of protein. Some carbs, some protein, and some sugars post-workout is a great combination. It's just a staple meal and I really enjoy it. So I'm gonna cook this real quick in the microwave. Like I said, the 60 grams, I'll do maybe like a cup to a cup and a half of water and then I throw it in the microwave for about a minute and a half. And then I throw the scoop of protein in afterwards. I guess some people do the scoop of protein and then put it in the microwave, but I feel like it kind of changes the texture a little bit. And to be honest with you, I don't like the texture after it's kind of been cooked. Like I feel like the cooked protein almost like I don't know, it's just different. There's something different about it and I'm not a huge fan. So I always go protein after I cook the oats, mix it up, get a nice mix, and then I'll have it from there. So let's get it going. I never really measure it. I just eyeball it. I don't feel like wasting the time to measure it. Besides, I've done it so many times that, you know, like most people, the more you do it, you just gotta eyeball it. So I get it like that kind of soupy texture and then that'll go in the microwave for about a minute to a minute and a half. All right, 60 grams quick oats has been made. So I'm gonna eat this, and then after this, we have another meal in maybe two hours, and then the final meal on the day, which I'll probably have like two hours to three hours after that. It's just a chicken meal and then another ground beef meal. That'll kind of round out the day. We got 14 weeks to run it up, grow, and uh, put in some good work. So I'll eat this, and then I'll check back in with you guys here soon. So let's go. Alrighty, front porch, back porch, we've been all over the place, but the plan is I'm gonna go check out Best Buy and possibly see if we can get a new camera lens. I have two lenses. The one I'm using right now is like my, more of my vlog lens, and then I have another kind of like still photography, more like, you know, good depth of field lens. But I wanna see if I could possibly get, you know, something in between, something I could possibly have as like a quick shoot photography lens as well as a vlog lens, kind of like a mix between it. Let's go hit Best Buy and uh, see what they got. All right, we just pulled up to Best Buy. I'm not going to take my camera in there because it's a little busy and I don't even know if they allow you to film in there. But if I catch anything or if I find anything good, I'll bring it back. I'll give you guys a little review, but let's go see what we got. All right, no success, but that's all right. We weren't able to find a deal. Um, saw a couple cool lenses that I definitely am considering, just don't have the money right now. But that gives me all the more reason to work harder, save up some money, and get something in the future. We're going to roll back home. About What time is it? It's 4.45. So I'm gonna roll home. The sun is at a pretty good spot right now because I'm trying to get some content. Let's go do that. Woo! The old on. Jeep and then the new Jeep over there, but we got old Jeep Jeep uh, repairs. On this thing. And if it's low, I'd run up there. And, and that's the, uh, that's my guy. That used to be my old one. And now uh, you know this, is, this is the new guy. All right, we are on to the next activity. Man on a mission today. So there's this little beach volleyball court right by my house down the path. So I'm gonna go walk over there. If we can't be at the beach, we might as well try to go replicate the beach. So I'm currently walking through the woods right now. Like I said, it's literally like a two minute walk from my house just through the woods. Um, and then I will be at the beach volleyball court. So let's go see if anyone's there. Hopefully they're not so that I can get some dope pictures or maybe I'll just shoot some pictures in the woods. Who knows? Oh, f there's someone here that blows. Some girl practicing her serves. She's working on her game. Uh, there's a basketball court over here, so maybe I can go shoot some pictures on the old basketball court. We might as well go shoot on the basketball court. Hopefully these kids that are playing don't care. Besides, the sun is over here, so that's a dope thing. So yeah, let's go check if these guys don't give me any a hard time. 
As y'all can see, it is blazing out here. We built up a crazy sweat. Sheesh. I appreciate you guys. Um, just having fun, living life, enjoying ourselves. Content got shot. I tried to dunk. Fingertips, baby. Fingertips. But uh, yeah, having a good time. So gonna go home, make some food. I think we're getting a cheat meal tonight. So stay tuned. Let's go. All right, we're back at the house. It's time to go get some dank food and. I don't know where my thing is, but the benefit of being on prep through holidays and through birthdays is that when you get gift cards, when you get gift cards for food places and you can't use them at the time, you get to use them later. So I have probably $500 worth of various gift cards to different locations. Um, so we're gonna utilize our gift cards today and go get some good food. So stay tuned, I'm gonna get some fire. It's a cheat day, not a cheat day, but a cheat day meal. So let's get it. Yeah. So apparently everybody and their mother wants to come to Buffalo Wild Wings tonight, but we have arrived. We just placed our order. I got 20 boneless wings, a sandwich, and some onion rings. I had to. We're here. We're enjoying our cheat day. It's going to be good. Um, I'm super excited. There's a bunch of girls in the background that are talking over me right now, um, but I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, appreciate y'all. So I don't know if I met you or not, but we have a 30 to 40 minute wait, so we are... For a hundred dollar order, yeah, we ordered a ridiculous amount of food. Uh, whatever, what are we watching? Suicide Squad 2. Suicide Squad 2. We're watching in the car, so uh, yeah. Have we'll fun. tune back in, have fun. Enjoy. Oh, that's what's his name from Guardians of the Galaxy. Food has finally arrived. It took forever, like 30 or 40 minutes, to be honest with you, but uh, we're satisfied, to say the least. What do we got? We got to open up a bag so we can show the people what we got. I'm also on live right now, doing a live on TikTok. We got a bunch of things going on. Um, so, just open up one thing. I might have to wait till we get home because there's like way too much yeah. shit in this car. We got to, wait. Uh, <laughs> we got to, to uh, yeah. We got way too much shit in the car to be doing a food review. So why don't I go live when I get home? Because uh, I do have to drive and I'm definitely not going to be going live while I drive. I ain't going live while I drive. So, I'm going to drive home. I'll get back on the live when I get home. We're like 15, 20 minutes from the crib. So um, tune back in in like 15 or 20 minutes, and I will catch you guys later. Adios. Hey. Oh, I want to eat. I... Can't you eat it in front of the movie? Sir, it is a cheat meal. You are indeed right. Oh, my fucking God, Johnny. Oh, my goodness gracious. Oh. Let me see what that is. What is that? Is that a Caesar salad? We got 18 things going on at once. Jesus Mom, Christ. Mom, how big a Caesar salad is. Cheers. Mmm. So good. Onion rings as well? We can. Just I'm out of breath. That was so much food, to be quite honest with you. Uh, but now we're just going to relax. Just crushed all that food. Not all of it. Saved a little bit. But uh, we're going to relax, watch a little movie, and then I will be back with y'all for the final meal of the night. So stay tuned. I'll see y'all. All right, we are back for our final meal. I am going to dice up a little more of that chicken just because I don't want it to go to waste. Um, and then I'm going to make a little more ground turkey. I think I'm going to take it easy on the rice that I have. I had that sandwich with a big-ass bun. To be honest, I probably don't need the rice. And I probably don't need the nuts. Um, so to be honest with you, I'll probably just have a little more of that protein. Drink some water. And that'll kind of round it out for the night. That uh, Buffalo Wild Wings was crazy. That was super delicious. So to kind of re recap, I ordered 10 boneless wings. I got spicy garlic, and it was buy one, get one free, 10. So it's like, bro, you can't, you can't not get buy one, get one free, 10 boneless wings. So got 20 and a sandwich and some onion rings. Crushed the sandwich, crushed the onion rings, crushed about 10 boneless wings. So to be honest with you, this final meal probably isn't even completely necessary. So get a little bit of protein in, drink some water, and then go to bed. Round it out. That'll kind of cut it, and that'll be it for the night. We are done, though. The uh, first vlog back in session. First vlog back on the channel. Back to uh, filming weekly videos. So if you guys made it this far, I truly appreciate it. Do not forget to like the video, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, if you want to go follow my other social medias, I'll throw them up on the screen somewhere. Uh, go check out my other videos as well. I do truly appreciate it. I'm going to try to bring you guys better and better content every week. Yeah, just keeping it consistent, staying positive. 
14 weeks out as well. I don't know if I mentioned that. 14 weeks out. So competing in November, 14 weeks out. Let's get it. I love you guys. Owie. Darling, you.